Paul McCartney jolted England's Glastonbury Festival with a little help from some rock star friends from across the pond. Bruce Springsteen and Dave Grohl dropped by Sir Paul's headlining set as the iconic event welcomed back pandemic-weary fans for the first time in three years. McCartney, 80, tore through Beatles songs like Can't Buy Me Love and solo tunes like Maybe I'm Amazed before he invited Foo Fighters frontman Grohl to join him for I Saw Her Standing There and Band on the Run. Following his friend from the west coast of America, McCartney introduced another surprise from the east coast of America. Springsteen then came out to play his tune Glory Days with Paul and help him sing the Fat Four's I Wanna Be Your Man. After running through seven more hits, McCartney invited the former Nirvana drummer and the boss back on stage to help him close the show with the end from Abbey Road. All told, McCartney performed 38 songs during the epic three-hour show, according to setlist.fm. Thank you Dave, thank you Bruce, thank you Glastow, McCartney told the rap show's audience before leaving the stage. Springsteen and the former Beatle had already come together last week for a MetLife Stadium show that also featured Jersey rocker John Bon Jovi. The five-day Bring Your Own Blues Glastonbury, held at Woody Farm, finally celebrated its 50th anniversary after a two-year delay, welcoming more than 200,000 fans. With his rock royalty studded set, McCartney became the iconic event's oldest ever headliner. Billie Eilish took center stage on Friday night and Kendrick Lamar was slated to headline Sunday's performances. With post wires, 